Oh, we got Dijkstra here. The, the leader that replaced the entire Syndicate archetype, apparently. No one else is playing uh, Horse Sun and everything else anymore. It's kind of funny that they released the archetype. It was uh, King of Beggars, mostly King of Beggars. You know, he was pretty popular, but other cards as well as... I think the leader variety was pretty healthy at that point. Ooh. <laughs> what? <laughs> um, okay. What a combo! Play 12 points to get out one cutthroat from the deck. Cut up Lackey. May your sword and arm be one. Guess he just wants it with Dectoning. I don't know. Maybe. Yeah. Got business for me. Okay, try to kill the cut up lackey. This don't work. Well, technically the second one does something. Whoa! Really? I'm a little surprised. Do I keep playing here? I can go to 11 and he might play some other units. Peace with humans? Advise us! Not even do that. Just just move it away. I'm not surprised that he played for the He's just going with money. Okay. Very flavorful. Oh snap. Okay. I managed to get out the ship. Okay, so we kick some dryads, all dryads. Ah, long ships are over races. I get more deck than ink. The waters of Brokula, their taste still upon my lips. I'll just throw the Kriat uh, Gabor here. All right, that's no problem. Yes. Okay, that's fine. I can't really move again much. Uh, this is an elf, and currently I do not have an elf. We might kick this. But unless we got Water or Broccolon, yeah, exactly. We can't Mulligan anymore. We gotta keep this. With the Elf Trigger, we got Dwarf Trigger, Human Trigger, Pan Panther, a Gnome, and Tree. So that's all we're gonna do with it. He has a lot of gold, but not a stupid amount, so. Talk to strangers. Life is eternal. Um, so hopefully no evolt here. Just to kill everything. Not playing Syndicate or No Realm. Okay, come on. I can win with something else too. Uh, I might just kill that.
Okay, let's just play the tree and boar. Winning with inferior factions. Actually, we are pretty much crushing people. Unless we run into... Uh, I don't know if it's hopeless. It's definitely not hopeless, but if we run into like an Ardal who just like... Put in every control card in the game. Just has everything as damage. But then it's a little hard. But it's not hopeless. That is all I need. Pretty good amount of points. In uh two cards. Next time it'll be personal. Three cards maybe. Yeah, three cards. Go back. Go for a boost. Uh, sadly, we have to play Francesca. Dana is not really an option. I'm gonna panther that. Yeah, I'm pantering it. Fifty-two points. Monsters are trashed here. <laughs> uh, why are you so so bad? Uh, well, I remember like I don't know, like two months ago, you guys were like, "Oh my God, make some monsters deck," and I and I and I tried to make a monsters deck off stream, but then we just forgot about that. I couldn't do it. It just it just, it was just not possible. I tried to make a Vault Hunt deck. It didn't go so well. It was pretty good at, at decisive fights. Very decisive. Lose every time. CDPR hate monsters. They have Necro flashbacks. They hate Aerodin Frost. So they butchered my boys. Vetter is in a terrible spot. Anyone who played uh, the old vent knows that Vetter used to be like such a such an interesting mechanic, and right now it's just like do two damage per turn. <laughs> That's not worth playing, and has hard counters. What the fuck? Swords, I see. Probably have to go back and uh, think about that a little bit. Yeah, but it's not super rich. Do you have a loyalty discount by chance? Am I just gonna lose to him? Let's say we kill this. Oh. Gubber might be a questionable card. We're not really getting the desired outcome. And also, we already have the the dwarf tag here because of him. Which is again not ideal. Maybe it lags in the heat while I'm at it. Here comes the Imba combo. As a girl, I always dreamed of having traits like this. Well, he needs a lot more money. Ha! 
Feel any burning? See a local healer or wise woman. Well, good luck doing. Um, Another month's cool gone in an instant. Well, four points. Well, more than four points. GG! We won by 41 points. Not too bad. Well played. Just gonna keep going up against Dijkstra's and see if we're gonna make some changes. Not that I made this deck to beat Dijkstra, I just made a good deck and, well, I'm calling it a good deck. Yeah, we don't need two of these. Also, I don't want to use two Panthers. We want to keep one Panther for last round. You definitely need to play this deck with a purpose. You're just like, okay, I, I want to have like, I want to save a lot of tags for later. Wow. That's, that's the first move. Oh, okay. Okay. That, that's the first move. Well, well, okay then. <laughs> um, let's just drive Ranger down one of the bare knuckle brawlers that I'd never see. Leave while you still stand. I guess he wants to play a lot of crimes. Remember GG him after? I will. But what? But it would be a sweeter GG if he actually crush him. This guy values thinning. I don't know why they buffed the eavesdrop. It's already one of the best game. Uh, it was all at 4 gold. It was already basically an auto include. Unless I don't know what the fuck you were doing. <laughs> but it was an auto include. Um, let's just trigger the off synergy. Weapons laugh to scorn. We want to play at most two more cards. Because we might want to play Gabor Zygrin next the consequences of your foolishness. He really wants to chase me out of this round. Yeah, and I think he did it. I feel like I'm just playing a completely different game from most of the players because they want to win round one super hard and they commit to it super hard and I always lose basically so I just play three cards but then we play round two um, I don't need a lot of Panthers fine Then we play round two, it's gonna be like, he plays up to two cards, else I'm gonna take a card advantage. Yeah, he, just, he just wants gold, uh, apparently, for now. This is one of my unique humans, so I don't know. But I, I think we gotta play something like this here. We might not get another human if we play this, but... Elves I have a lot of. A panther, Eternal I got two panthers. Okay. Mm. Peace with humans? I buy those! Mm. There's one way we can lose this, and uh, that's if he plays Evolt with uh, just Evolt, because that card is just totally broken.
I'm considering playing the hero power here. And I think we have to. Yeah, well, this is just stupid. Imagine he spams Igor on those. Ah, long ships Do it. Looks like he's embracing his uh, card disadvantage. He's just preparing for the next round. Mm. Well, we probably have to play Gabor next turn. Uh, hopefully, uh, if he keeps playing here. Because we're getting close to the point. Yeah, fuck. Ha! Unfortunately, we can't Gabor now. It's better than the album Swordmaster. We could just get this out, but we don't have a dryad. Actually, we have a dryad in hand. We have an elf, so this is fine. I can start by playing. I gotta decide which row we're gonna play on. It seems like we're gonna play on the melee row. Oh. So I have two units that trigger on the melee row. This doesn't have a preference. Uh, this is uh, more reliable on the melee row. It's an 8th on the melee row, but it can be more valuable on the range row. But I will not have a lot of units on the range row. I think we're just gonna play on the melee row. I just do play into the Great Oak. What's your opinion, Dryad Fledling's new voice? Do you like it or not? What? I was not paying attention too much because, frankly, I, I had the Dryad Fledgling uh, for, for a long time with the Japanese voice. And it kind of... What new voice? Do you have a new voice? What new voice? We need more information here. Pumping the wood naked? Yeah, but we already know that, but like what new voice? <laughs> so do they like it rough? You wouldn't understand. They changed it weeks ago. Lost sound for a second. Well, oh, that would be nice to kill. So, the problem is if I play the dwarf, elf, or the dryad, then this is going to have a higher cooldown. But I can't play Barnabas, and I can't play the Great Oak. But it probably makes more sense to save the Great Toe. I think we just gotta play the Dryad here. And kinda hope that this works. Deal 
Why play front when you can make him immune though? Uh, poor the Great Oak. Also, it doesn't really matter. Like, if he dies, like, shouldn't he target something else instead? By playing him on the front, we're gonna have a uh, better Great Oak. Why have the feeling that uh, Townsfolk is going to come down soon? Punch, punch, punch. Uh, this might matter. I guess I'm just going to go Dennis. If I had some damage saved up, actually that would have been brutal. I should have saved the damage I have. Because we could have had a Townsfolk Murder Paradise here. I only have 5 damage now. I, I was sitting on a lot of damage. At least I could have saved Bran, so I'm threatening 8 damage. I suppose it wouldn't have mattered that much. Okay, we're gonna move the ship in the back, so we're gonna have more units in the back. I don't think it's gonna matter, he's just gonna get out another Townsfolk in the front, right? Dipping in the Pontar. So we blow up the Townsfolk. While well, we can. Oh, that stitching. Yeah, the Townsfolk came from the circle, but we managed to kill one. What do you think, dearest? It matches more of As a girl, I always dreamed of having dreams like this. Will I just insta lose to this? Another month's cold gone in an instant. I suppose I will. So yeah, this is a problem because how can I shut this down? How many points he managed to get out that was impossible to shut down with the exception of Artifact Counter? And maybe like super high damage. Igni? Igni does do a good job here. I'll give you that. But this would only work if we have actually the, the, the last say. Because he managed to do all this in one fucking round. He managed to get... How much is this? Oh, we can turn it on, right? 46 points on the first row in one round. Very questionable. Very questionable. I think you really like this one. Can't say I really like that. You know, guys, if they want to cheese me, holy crap. Do you guys want to see the Cyrus deck? We can try that. Well played.